James Gabriel, uh, who fights uh, Conrad Padilla tomorrow night for Bloodsport Championship. You're out of uh, Ace uh, MMA fight. Now, uh, this is going to be his first professional fight, but he's coming out of uh, Jackson's MMA. How do you feel uh, about him coming out of such a big camp, or do you think you got him on experience? Well, you know, um, we're going to see what happens, you know. We're going to see what happens. We're going to get in the ring, you know. He should be very confident. He's been training for several months. He's uh, he's kept his weight the whole time, 145. He's been training at least five days out of the week with several people that are very well known in the valley. Um, uh, several of the fighters have been helping him out. We've been training. Louis, with his experience, has also been training him. Uh, you know, so we're very proud to have him on the Ace MMA fight team. This is going to be the fight team debut here in El Paso, Texas, my home city. So it's very exciting for me, and I know that we'll be very well represented by James Gabriel. All right, man. And um, just uh, real quick, do you, do you know anything about the way he fights? I know it's his MMA debut. Well, I know um, from when I looked at him on, on the computer. Striker, you know. He has a record uh, two takeos, you know, first round. So hey, um, I plan on just going in there, throwing those hands. And, uh, you know, if you hit him too hard, I know he's gonna strike me. Well, you know, try to take him to the ground and. All right. And okay. well, what, what, what you know about him? Uh, did it affect the way you prepared for the fight, or you just approach it uh, how, uh, how you always approach it? I know that I'm the truth, so it don't matter. It don't matter who I step in the ring with. You know, he has to. I am the truth. Three years of wrestling experience, so if it goes on the ground, guarantee a win. And he's been training on his stand-up. He has the fastest hands that you've ever seen. And he's gonna show it tomorrow. All right, man. Well, we definitely look forward to that fight and uh, very modest. And uh, thank you guys, uh, Ace MMA fight tonight. <laughs> We're here with uh, Conrad Padilla, who fights out of Jackson MMA and Mean One MMA. He's Keith Jardine's gym. Um, now, this is your uh, pro MMA debut. How do you feel uh, going into your first fight? I'm feeling excited. Uh, I'm, I'm nervous that I'm not really nervous about this fight. You know what I mean? I, I've trained really hard. Uh, my hands are there. I worked a lot of mid-time, so uh, I feel good condition-wise, health-wise, weight-wise, everything. So. Well, I mean, you're coming out of uh, two big gyms, not just uh, Keith Jardines, but Jackson MMA is, uh, you know, pretty much the best one out there right That's now. It, yeah. um, how do you feel that uh, helps you into the fight? Uh, I think it helps me huge. I mean, we got the best training partners in the world. I mean, even at the amateur level, those guys are already professional contenders. I mean, everybody there just brings a great, great amount of talent to the table. And, uh, you know, even, even the guys that are just novice are awesome. So, I mean, we, we got... Great, great training partners at both gyms, you know? Yeah, well, now you're fighting uh, James Gabriel. Do you know anything about the way he fights or what he brings to the table? I've got no clue about this guy. I, I've looked him up on the internet, everything. You know, I always do my homework on my opponents, but uh, this guy, this guy's a mystery to me. So I'm just going to go out there. I'm going to have my fun. I'm going to, you know, throw my hands and do my thing. And whatever happens, wherever he wants to lose, okay. that's fine with me. <laughs> well, I mean, uh, you, uh, you don't know anything about his style, right? Uh, no. But I mean, what do you plan to do yourself? Uh, what, how would you describe your style, your approach to fighting? Uh, well, I got, I got six TKOs as an amateur, so, uh, you know, if he goes to the ground, I mean, I'm real confident on the ground. I beat six guys into the ground, so uh, if he wants to stand and bang, you know, hey, you know, I got some kickboxing too, so. All right, well, so, you know, like I said, wherever he wants to lose, you know, it's fine with me. Those TKOs you got from ground and pound? Ground and pound. Wow. And then the first two minutes, so, uh, you know, my, my first five fights maybe lasted ten minutes total, so. <laughs> so you sound like you have uh, some quick fights. Uh, now you're going in there to win, obviously. Um, how would you like the fight to go if it does go, everything goes your way? You know, I'm just, I'm just looking to get in there, finish the fight as early as possible, you know. You don't get paid for overtime, so, <laughs> you know what I mean? Go in there, put on a good show for the fans, and uh, hopefully get invited back to El Paso. I remember, well, I mean, you're coming out of a uh, big camp, so we definitely expect great things from you, and we're looking forward to you. I hope I can perform for you. Oh, <laughs> All right, you. appreciate it, man. Appreciate it.